Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, the time has come for us to start this run officially! Hello everyone and welcome back to more of the Majora's Mask 3 Heart Run. The last time! Oh my god, I forgot about this menu. Ah, my ears. But last time, we went through Cycle 1. We did all the fun Cycle 1 stuff from the Vanilla ROM, and now we're here with the randomized one. How is it randomized? My hearts aren't supposed to be purple. <laughs> I made them purple because I can, that's why. So, this version of the randomizer... Oh my god. Uh, you know what? Oh, no, I'm not gonna pause it. We'll just... So, there was actually an update to the randomizer, but I made this wrong before I learned that update even existed. So, we're basically playing an older version, but it doesn't really matter because we're using vanilla layout anyway, so... Anyway, we're going to get right into it because my ears are dying. Oh my god! <laughs> we still have all the cutscenes, though. That mask. A skull could use the power that mask to do those terrible things. Well, whatever it takes. We gotta do something about it. The swamp, mountain, oceans, and cave the tale was trying to tell us about. I bet it was referring to the four areas just outside of town. There's one in each compass direction. What do you suppose he meant by the four who are there? I have no idea. He always skips important stuff. Guys, we're just going to find out. We go through that gate straight ahead, and we head in the direction of the swamp. So as you can see, I made my hearts purple. My seat buttons are different colors. All my menu buttons are different colors. And even the menu is a different color, but I didn't do anything about that. So we still have the bombs. We don't, for some odd reason, bottles and the Deku nuts aren't in the the list for extra items. So even if I wanted to have bottles, which we wouldn't have, I couldn't put them in. But we still have the bombs. We have the Deku mask, which we're supposed to have. We also have a D-pad, where we can just use the ocarina and the Deku mask, whatever we want. I don't want my magic is lower. I also made the magic bar red. <laughs> we still have the Song of Healing. Song of Time is something we have to have. We don't have the Bomber's Notebook, because we didn't actually get the Bomber's Notebook. And the password will be different anyway. And we have the Clock Tower map. So we have basically everything, except for the... The freaking Deacon nuts. But that doesn't matter. Anyway, we're not gonna be playing with inverted. So oh, ho, ho, ho. I can also change the the sun, the moon, and the general clock. So we're gonna go grab the stray fairy before we leave. Also, let's get this over with first. Let's put on the mask. We have to watch the cutscene at least once. So I made the Link's tunics red, except for Deku Link, because I went with the banana form. <laughs> because I was, I was reading, I was watching streams one day, and when I saw, when I literally read a random comment that talked about how Deku Link being a banana, and I was like, wait, what? So I tried it, and I was like, whoa, what? This looks hilarious. So that's why we're doing it. Stop right there! Having you some errand in the swamp is dangerous outside the Taiwan, so I can't allow a child like you to. The sword. My apologies, sir. There's all for me to treat you like a child. A southern swamp that would follow wise instructions. Be careful. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. So, yeah, that's why we're using Banana Deku Link. Every other tunic is red. So, there's at least some consistency, but, you know, if you don't like yellow, then I'm sorry, but we're, we're just gonna have to suck it up and do it. I gotta say, I'm just gonna have to deal with it, cause I can't change it now. Otherwise, I'd have to go and make another ROM. I really don't want to do that. So we're just gonna, we're just gonna do it, All right? Anyway, we're gonna try. The goal for today is to get to Woodfall right away. Shut up, cow. Oh, I remember this. Tail and I drew this with the skull when we first met him. He told us that he'd been fighting with his friends and that they'd left him all alone.
I'm sure it was because he was always playing tricks, so nobody wanted to play with him. But to do what he did just because of that? Once he got his power. Now we're in the hot mess with- SHUT UP COW! Now we're in the mess with now- WAIT! DID I GO AND HIT THE OWL?! Oh, fuck me. I had to go back. I don't think I hit the owl statue over here. And it's kind of important that we do because we need to be back in Clock Town. Before the mayor's residence closes. Because we want to get... The cafe's mask. If I didn't hit the owl, then I'm gonna have to come back. I won't be able to warp back here and want to grab the song of soaring. Also, well, you know, I'm gonna save that story for when we get to it. But right now, I just need to make sure I hit the owl. No, I didn't. Good thing I came back for it. Because it would have been a real travesty if I decided not to do it. Because we kind of need that out. I'm already down like a quarter of a heart. And I do have death equals moon crash on. So if I die, then yeah, all my progress goes bye bye. I did believe the rule. I wrote down the rules and put them in the description. So that way, if I don't end up saying anything like an idiot, like I always tend to, then it's all right there in your description. So we don't have to worry about it. So yeah, the goal is to get the song of soaring and reach woodfall today, and then probably after that we'll do some fun stuff later. We are not going to be finishing all of the things we have to do in Woodfall. Yeah, okay. Give me a magic, actually. I need that. We won't be finishing everything we can do in Woodfall. Uh-oh. In chase. Alright. So while we're here, we actually have to get the map. I am actually impressed at hit! I'm not gonna read the text again because we already did it before. Alright, how much is Woodfall? 20?! Wow, wait a- Bump up the price, pal! Clock Town map was 5! You know what, we can actually get 20 rupees in here. Gosh, I don't have to waste time getting some rupees. We actually do kind of want to grab this. And grab this! The Deku Stick! We've- I'm pretty sure we all know how- Really?! You just- I'm pretty sure we all know how Deku Sticks work, so... I don't think we need any introduction. Big 20 in here. I've checked this grotto more times than I can care to remember when doing randos. As in, it's one of my early checks because it's super easy to get. Okay, now! Tingle, give me your map! I got have your 20 rupee! Tingle, you- There we go. I am on a time crunch here, pal! Give me your map. Thank you. <laughs> Fortunately, we can carry up to 200 rupees, so we're fine in that department. I don't have to worry about the frogs, fortunately. But yeah, welcome to Southern Swamp, where there's poison water that will kill you if you're not a Deku! Alright, get this owl. It's important that we get these owl spots as early as possible so I don't forget about them. Because knowing me, I'll probably forget about them. And that's no good. But anyway, while we can swim across this water, because this water isn't poison, we're just going to use Deku because it's faster. I don't have continuous Deku hopping on, so we have to play the game the way, way Nintendo intended, even though I'm using... basically using emulation. Just something that the 
designers of this game was not intending. All right, we have money for another map. But we want to come to the Woods of Mystery. And because I've played Rando a lot of times, and by a lot of times I mean a few, I actually know how to do this room. You go to the left, then to the right, then to the right, then straight, use Tiku for speed, and then to the left, and then to the left. And just like that, you can get through Woods of Mystery on day one with no problem. I was just busy minding my own business, picking mushrooms, and BAM! I got hit from behind! That pesky skull kid! Do you think an old hag wouldn't recognize him if he hit his face? Oh, Owl, to think he's that powerful, and now I can't even move! You! Don't you have anything that gives you energy? Yeah, no, we don't. Ah, what is this? You're no help! I say you're not all like you make yourself out to be! Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Alright, let's go. We need to come back. But you know, it makes me wonder though, when did Skull Kid do all of this? We don't really get a general time frame as to when he got his hands on Majora's Mask. All we know is, ever since he started doing it, he started doing things like that! So, you know, no, not really any answers to our questions. Wait, anyway, we need to come to the Magic Hags Potion Shop. Welcome! My potions work very well, they do! Ben Drown fans, eat your hearts out. What's that? The Skull Kid got to kill me! That's ridiculous! If that's just the Skull Kid, then what harm could he possibly do? Um, have you looked outside, lady? Oh, well, if that's true, then take this potion over. This is good. Red potion bottle! Red potions replenish health! I have to use the bottle. Save the bottle for storing things. And then you know how to use a red potion. Alright, so now we have to go back. <laughs> I want to get this all done so we can get to Song of Soaring before night one. But with the clock going as fast as it is, I doubt we'll even get to... Song of Soaring before night one, which is pretty, pretty bad. But yeah, just go through here again. It's not that hard. It's very easy. These enemies aren't that intimidating. As long as they can't eat you. We are getting some good puns out of this. Don't hit me. Alright! That little detour to buy the map was kind of a fiasco, but we're, we're in. So all we gotta do is give her the red potion. I still have no bombs? <laughs> Where? What? Wow. Okay. Here you go. Ah! That color! That smell! That's definitely Kotaki's! Wow, nice. I'm trying to help you steal my freaking bottle. Ooh, feel the energy flow! Kume is revived! You saved me! I'm the Swamp Tour Guy! I'm at the boat cruise, so come by if you want a free ride! <laughs> Alright! Well, we did that, so let's go. Like I said, we're on a time crunch. We need to get back to clock time before night, but I doubt we're gonna get that at this point. Oh, hi! You have strange powers, no? Mimi has been watching you. Lately, that swamp filled with poison water. Temple above waterfall, strange. Mother go to temple. But brother no able to find temple entrance. Temple for Tiku only. Brother captured by Tiku. Now in palace. Help! You know what the funny thing with these monkeys is? If you follow them. Yo, I won't show it. I won't show it. It's funny. If you follow them. Once they reach a certain point. They will literally despawn out of existence. Like boop. <laughs> like that. They just despawn out of existence. It's hilarious. I love it. And meanwhile, that big octo over there is just staring at us. It's kind of disturbing, but whatever. It's a problem. But yeah, we got that taken care of. But yeah, I love that. There's another thing like that, but you only really see it if you have fast cutscenes on. And it's the Pirate Fortress, which we won't be seeing for a while. Hi. Oh, thanks for what you did back there. 
a special deal just for you. Why don't you take this cruise for free? Nice. Ah, yes, we got special going on right now, so give me this stuff for free. And we got the pictograph box, which we're probably only going to need to use one time in this entire playthrough. You can shoot only one photograph at a time. You can retake it as many times as you like. You know, it's kind of interesting how Termina has things like this that Hyrule didn't have. If you take a nice picture from the boat, take it to that fellow over there. All right, the boat's leaving. Oh, then it's time for my fun, my fun favorite. This boat goes incredibly fast if you ha have the right setting on. This is not how fast this boat is supposed to go normally. I didn't even read that text. But yeah, fast boat because I don't want to waste any damn time. We're literally gonna go there like half the time it would normally take. Bye, Big Doctor. We're already here. Also, oh no, it's this area. Okay, no, okay, whoa, what the hell? Now we're having a DQ Palace. The Swamp Bar is poisonous here, so please watch your step. All right, okay, now, I don't know why we're over there like that, but. Over there! So I have a funny story once of a rando run I was doing, kind of like, you know, just for fun. Also, welcome to Deku Palace. We are not going to be exploring this place right now because we're basically just gonna go in the complete opposite direction. We don't actually have to go inside yet. That's the funny thing. We can completely skip this place right now and go this way. And as part of my roundabout strategy, we are going to do that. So anyway, I was going to go on about my story. So this area over here was the cause of my death once. And because I typically play rando with death equals a moon crash on. What you say? Oh, no, 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 no. Fuck you. Get in the fire! Oh, my God. Sorry. Fight! No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I don't have time for you. Come here. Fight! But, yeah. So, there's a speedrunning trick to where you can get up here from down there. I tried to do it, failed, and, you know, I think we all know what happened after that. Because the swamp water is poison. I died. Ooh, this is a rare sight. You are a fairy child, correct? I'm a DQ. Thank you very much. What business what you have in this poison swamp? If you dare not venture further, I shall pass no judgment. It is better that you hurry back to town. This swamp you are in has lost its guardian deity, but it was destined to fade anyway. Hoo hoot! And that destiny is not solely limited to this swamp. If you have the courage and determination to proceed in the face of destiny, then it shall teach you something useful. Before coming here, had you not seen any of the stone statues that bear close resemblance to me? Yes. I have placed these throughout the land. Oh my gosh, I heard a loud noise. I'm sorry. Okay, ahem. I have placed these throughout the land to aid the one with the power to change the destiny of this land. Wherever he may appear. How did you even do that? Those statues are like big... You know what? Forget it. I don't even know. If you have left proof of our encounter on any of those stone statues, then the song carved at my feet will certainly be of some assistance. Remember it well and then play it when the, when the need arises. When the first time you play this song, we shall become eternal friends, transcending time and place. Okay, why don't I take off the mask for this, specifically? Notes are carved in the stone. And, you know, Link's been through this fiasco before, so he knows what to do. The Song of Soaring. This melody swoops you up and sends you soaring to a stone bird statue in an instant. Alright, so now that we did that, let's get back to our regularly scheduled business. So yeah, while we're go before we go off, I'm probably going to play that cl the clip of what happened after I had my horrible experience. So, future me, you know... <clears throat> I forgot about Seikon, there's still him. 
Yeah, we can do safe time, no problem. I didn't, I didn't slow time again. Whoops. Ah, oh, crap! Shit! Damn it! Fuck! No! 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 Wait! Get out of the water! No! Well, shit! Goodbye, Termina! We aren't supposed to be here right now, but we're coming here to get the Apple statue, and then we're gonna fly back to Clock Town. Bye. He fell in the water! Wow! Speaking of the water, this water is all poison, so be careful. But yeah, all we're here for is that Apple statue over there. It's almost night. I don't know how long the mayor's place is open till. Oh shit! No! <laughs> Bye! Alright, nice. We spawned right here. We're basically right there. Alright. We might actually be able to do, like, DQ Palace too. Isn't that the DQ scrub mark? I wonder if they're what they worshipped here. Who knows? I don't care. We have an owl to activate. And now we have the owl activated, we're gonna head straight back to Clock Town. It's too late to get the room key, which is a shame. I think it is. Yeah, it, it probably is. Can we actually? No, we can't skip it. I'm so used to rando, dude. When it, you can just, when it just go super fast. But anyway, since we're here in Clock Town, we want to, real quick, dash on over to the mayor's residence. I know that we have to go see the Great Fairy again, because we have a straight fairy. But it's like we have plenty of time to do that. Also, we have to see this. I should have went to North Clock Town. Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it. Please tell me this place is open until like 8! Well, it doesn't tell me. All right, we're in. We just gotta rush on over here. You're still here? Oh dear, are you on a field trip? Or are you the expert person finder I hired? Yes, 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 I say you have the face of a pro. The characters is the person I want you to find. Yes, yes, I know them. The person I want you to locate is my son, Cafe. You know him, don't you? You don't? Really? He disappeared about a month ago. It's terrible! I'm so very worried. I can't get food down my throat and I've lost five pounds! I'm not even gonna comment on that. You haven't done anything, though. Oh, oh dear. Well, could you look for him? Yeah, sure. <laughs> oh my, of course. You are an expert. Well, I'm counting on you. And we get Cafe's mask and we're recruited to find his person. Where is this to inquire about the missing cafe? Oh, hi, Clock. If we come in here, too, before we leave, unless I get kicked out soon, you can find Cafe's Diary. The wedding ceremony is soon. It might be early if I finish my wedding mask. I wonder if Anju has made hers. She tends to do things at the last minute, so probably not. There's a gathering of the fellows at the milk bar tonight. I plan to show off my wedding mask and talk about my sweetheart as fast as I can. Oh, gosh. <laughs> uh, we're gonna 
delve into that side quest, not now, but much later, when we have all the fins damp lately. That's the grinning used among us Zoras. Oh, forgive me, I am Toto, manager of the band, the Indiegogos. I am out of business cards, so a Zora greeting will have to do. The Indiegogos is the popular group that we Zora are so proud of. They put out a lot of songs. One of their hits is Ballad of the Windfish. You know that song, don't you? Maybe. Huh? You don't? Really? Even one that famous? Hmm. You'd be able to hear it if the show wasn't cancelled. It's such a shame. Oof. Alright. I'm trying to think here. Is there anything we can do right now? Well, I mean, other than the Great Fairy? Well, actually, no, there isn't. So we're gonna go straight back. To Southern Swamp to take care of business there. There is stuff we still have to do over in Southern Swamp, so let's take care of it. Why don't we? We will need a couple of items, though, before we progress. So let's take our bottle and get some water. And then we will take advantage of the Swamp Photography Contest to... Cause I wonder if that will actually count. Eh, good enough. Not even the first day, though. So, at midnight on the first night, we have to wait for Seikon. But by the time we're done with this, we'll be able to be there in time for Seikon. Blimey, where is he? That spoiled child is all playing hooky again. Child this age is no business searching for fairies. Oh, and welcome. I don't know why I completely changed his voice in moments of notice. Well, then why don't you show me the photograph? You why did I change his voice again? I don't know. Here you go, buddy. Ooh, this is a big arc tool. I'm pretty sure others are taking photographs of those before, but... Well, if you get too close to one of those things, it'll suck you in, so it's pretty hard to take a decent shot. Alright, give me another boat cruise. <laughs> you must really like that boat cruise! Alright, off you go! Yeah, shit, yeah, totally. I love the boat cruise, yeah. We are totally not taking advantage of this to get back to Deku Palace faster. No, totally not. Please enjoy the swamp scenery to your heart's content. Yeah, so much swamp scenery. Wow. Oh my goodness. Look at this excellent scenery. Um, why am I over here, though? Oh my. There was an Octorok there. Oh my gosh, look at this scenery! Oh! <laughs> okay. We are just marking. Alright, so we need to do this quick. Not really that bad, but it all depends on my stealth skills, which are practically not instant. Howdy. This is the palace of the Deku Kingdom! Only well, knows our official business manager! You may enter to see the public humiliation of the fullest monkey who angered our king. Follow this hall straight to the royal chamber. Do not enter any other areas whatsoever. And by that, he means completely ignore what he says and go this way. So at night, these guys have a line of sight that you can very clearly see. Oh, crap. Shit. Damn it. I, I should have went where I did. I should have went right then and there. Damn it. Oh! <laughs> All right, we're in. Now it's time for the next part. This part's easy, right? It's easy, right? It's easy, right? Kazam! Easy mode. <laughs> First try. Let's go. All right, now it's time for Mister. This guy. Uh, well, you're the first country I've had in a long time. Do you need any magic beans? They sprout leaves as soon as you wire them. That they do, they do. Mm. I'll give you one free sample, so try planting in some soft soil. You can always buy more. Alright, so we got the magic beans. We actually have to get them from him first in order to buy more. It's similar to another item we get later, but in that case, there's a test in order to be able to use them. So in that case, it actually makes sense. I actually didn't put down some of this stuff in my driver. So I'm just gonna take a second to... to... Alright. 
Really, in reality, we only ever need one magic bean. Ever. But, you can plant them wherever you want, but if you don't want them, the leaves won't grow. Yeah, sure, thanks, buddy. Alright. Tiku Link can't use magic beans, but Human Link can. And we have spring water, so we're fine. And now it's time for the easy part. Just walk right into this guy's sight. Aha! An intruder! Ow. So now that we have the magic beam. You know what? This right, we might we might be able to do this just in time. Time is going pretty quick. Alright, let's kill this guy first. I was say, why are my hits not doing anything? So plant the beans here. If you come here on day two, it's raining, so you don't actually need spring water there. Alright then, but we're doing this on day one, so we need the spring water. And just like that, we have Ascension! Alright, here we go. And... <laughs> Boop, there it is. I mean, this is an N64 game, so I'm not surprised that actually happened. So yeah, all we gotta do is sneak our way through these guys. I was say if that hit, that was that, was... Th that one hit though? Okay. Well we're on a time crunch, so we need to hurry up. I don't wanna have to back out halfway through. Oh my god, I almost fell! Eh. Hit him. Nice. Go, go, go. Eh. Alright. So I think after we do this, we're gonna end it there because we're already at like 30 minutes. I can see my recording time. So. Really? There we go. Actually, no, wait. I have a better idea. We'll do this. Then we'll do Seikon. Then we'll end. Oh! oh my god. There you go. Alright, we're in the clear. I just need not mess. Damn it, I have to wait for this one! I don't I don't trust that. We're gonna try it. Okay, good. We made it. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, we're in. So this is where we need to go. If we can talk to the monkey. They keep saying I kidnapped her! No matter how many times they say, it's not going to bring the princess back! If they're not careful, the princess will fall victim to a monster! Why won't they believe what I say? Fine, I get it. Then I shall say nothing more to you. Punish me or do whatever else you might. Alright, so we want to take out our, our pipes. Oh! You have them! You do! Just like the princess! Deku pipes! Those were great! By the way, who are you? <laughs> Whoa! That's what I'm putting out! Just listen to me! I was trying to find out about the poison in the swamp, so I went to the Woodfall Temple and put the waterfall. But the temple had become a monster's lair, and the princess was captured by the monster. Since the Deku King thinks I kidnapped the princess, he won't listen to a word I say! Now the princess is in trouble, so I must somehow hurry to the temple and save her. Do you understand my plight? Yeah, sure. So then, that means you will go in my place and save the princess! Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay, now I'll teach you the melody that opens the temple. The princess taught it to me. We can't let them hear us, so I'll sing it softly. And then we're gonna play on our loud ass pipes! Also, what this is a song, so I'm gonna put it on the tracker, thanks. Yeah, we're just gonna quietly play this song on our loud ass pipes. Because totally. And they're all listening. Wow, good job. Good job, Wink. You done fucked up. Oh, 
I love how the only one who's not looking is the butler. He's just kind of just hanging out. You learn the Sonata of Awakening. This melody awakens those who have fallen into a deep sleep, and you actually use this more than once. Everyone, did you hear that? <laughs> this melody, which only the Deku royal family knows, it proves the foolish monkey deceived the princess so he can enter the temple. Everyone, let the monkey's punishment commence! Ack. <laughs> you better take the shortcut the Deku people used to get to the Windfall Temple! But you must hurry! If you don't, I'll be punished by the Deku King! Blech. Alright, well we have the Sonata, and give me just a moment, I'll be right back. Alright, we're back. So, I forgot to put the box in my tracker, so we have that now. And before we end it, let's go do a Seikon. Because really, I think that's all we'll basically have time left for. And then after that, well, there is one other mask we can get after midnight. So I might as well grab that too, because that one's a quick one. Unfortunately, it will serve us zero purpose, but whatever, I guess. <laughs> Alright, wait, wow, we actually have a bit of time. And whatever, it's fine. You know what? Yeah, let's go grab the Great Fairy's Mask while we're here. We're not going to be using it right away, but we may as well grab it, right? We actually do want to go in there as a human this time. It's actually important that we do go in here as a human. All the tattles can yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, get ready for the voice again, ladies and gentlemen. Do I have- have I taken, like, any damage in, like, the past two minutes? Oh. Well, oh, she restored my magic. Okay, thank you. Oh, kind young one! Scattered throughout the four temples of this land, no broken stray fairies like me! Please find a way to save them and return them to their former- To their fountains! Words are hard, okay? I'm sorry! Surely they will add to your strength! Allow me to grant you something good so that stray fairies will fear you! Yeah, look at how beautiful we'll look with this great fairy mask! Stray fairies will fly to you when you wear it. You'll know when you're close to a fairy who's lost to a temple with the mask's hair begins to shimmer. Come see me whenever your quest has made you weary! <laughs> yeah, I don't think I will. Goodbye, great fairy. Alright, we're out of here. We have a date with a thief. Oh my god, walk backwards, please. Thank you. But yeah, we have a date with a thief. Very shortly, actually. He's almost here. We can just hang up. He's right over there, actually. We just saw him. There he is. There he, there's the fucker now. So, let's just get ready for the fun time. Isn't that right, Jim? He's not listening. But yeah, the old lady should be coming right now. Jesus Christ, he's moving fast! Alright, here he comes. Dude, what the fuck? Why did they move so quickly? Maybe I'm just used to inverted speed. Alright, go, go, go. Oh, you went slow. Holy crap, I missed him like twice! <laughs> anyway, there's a setting in the randomizer to where we could just... We don't have to watch him leave. Thank you. Since he didn't make off with them, I can finally stop bomb bags at our shop. Maybe I'll put them out tomorrow. Uh? Yes, I must thank you. It's a dangerous mask, but maybe you should could use it to throw your own festival fireworks show. And we get the blast mask! We can have a blast with B, but you'll lose life energy in the process, so yeah, I'm probably never gonna use it because we have three hearts. 
Yeah, thanks for helping me. Take care. All right, well, that's another mask on our list. But now that we've done that, there is one more thing we can do before we end it. On midnight of any night, we can come out here to North Terminal Field. And somewhere nearby over here is this guy. You'll know he's there because of the weird music. Oh. I am no longer part of the living. My sadness to the moon. I haven't left my dance to the world. I am filled with regret. Oh. Translation, I am disappointed, oh moon. I have died! Oh, I plan to bring the world together and stir it into a giant melting pot with my dance. If only I taught my new dance to someone. The game doesn't really give you a clear hint of this, but just play the Song of Healing. He's dead, so, you know. Oh. Spread my dance across the world. Train its followers. Yeah. Translation, I have tied to you. Now make it to a popular dance craze. And we get Kamaro's mask, which we will not be using because we only get a heart piece out of this. Oh. I am counting on you. Uh. I am counting on you. And there he goes, off to the afterlife, with another mask in tow. And something just fell off my desk. Anyway, we're gonna end things there. Wait, there is one more mask we can get. <laughs> I'm so sorry. There's too many masks we can get right now. We have to go back to clock down again. I literally looked at my tracker and I just remembered. Oh, wait, there's still one more mask. I also forgot to put down that we have one model. <sighs> okay. But yeah, there's still one more mask we can get. This is another one we can get on the first or second day, actually. We can't get it on the final day because, for obvious reasons, everyone will have evacuated Clogtown by now. And I feel it's just best to get these easy masks out of the way early, so that way we don't have to worry about them later. Like, we're probably going to spend the whole of day two doing important things. And by important things, we'll talk about it next time. Once we do this, I'll end the episode for reals. Promise. But yeah, we have you. La la la, they said it was much too loud when I practiced in my room. You know, I get pretty mad too if all I can hear is that for 12 hours a day. They got mad. Uh, now I'm sad. I'll just think about the past to keep my mind off the bad. Ah, yes, I'll do that. Dear guest, long ago I was in animal troop with dogs and donkeys and such. Why could a, why could a, why could a man join? That's because a man is an animal too, my boy. My boy. They were all great, but there was one thing I didn't like about it. Why was the, why was the, why was the dog the leader? Was it because there was something wrong with me, sir? Oh, that dog was an amazing leader. He always had a stellar troop no matter what animals he had to work with. That's why I, that's why I, that's why I stole it. The dog's mask. I stole it. I wanted it because it was the leader's mask. But I no longer need it. I give it to my guest. And we get the Bremen Mask! It belongs to the leader of the animal troop. Try praying it around tiny young animals. The leader was a good instructor. His members matured quickly and they became adults in an instant. So that's a tip as to what the Bremen Mask's purpose is. But speaking of purposes, we are going to end things there. We're going to hit up an owl statue. And I'm going to try to save state. I'm gonna try to save state off screen, actually. And next time, on the Majora's Mastery Heart Run, we are going to enter Woodfall Temple, but not actually complete it, because there's a reason why we want to go to Woodfall Temple and then not complete it. But we'll see next time. But anyway, I'll see you then.